All right, well, you know, there's Ford lovers and there's Dodge lovers, and if your Ford don't go, call in a Dodge. So as everybody knows in the previous video, my Ford don't go. She hasn't been started for a year. It's a year later, and now we're gonna try to start it bum starting it with a Dodge. Dodge sure looks like a spring chicken with 474,000 kilometers. Oh well, it's hard to believe that thing's got a lot less kilometers on it, but anyways. That's why Dodge advertises that it's the most dependable truck in Canada right now. Hmm. Let's let's find out. You ready? Don't go till I say so. Okay, glow plugs are warming up. Go! Key is on. I'm in second gear and four high. Go! And we're moving. Faster! 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 And let's pop the clutch. And it's running. Amazing. That was quick. I wonder why it started so easy just by giving it a tow. I'm not going to let my foot off the gas for a bit. She idle. Let's try very slowly. She's running on her own. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> Here smells like Ford. Now we're out to go for a cruise. It's not easy. Yeah. yeah. Just need a little dodge to kick it in the ass. Yeah. This truck's like brand new. Drives nicer than your Ford, doesn't it? I have to get dodge. <laughs> I bet. I guess so. Well, go for a cruise in this one too and see what it feels like before you buy a new Dodge. Lovely. That's reverse. And we're off. Ford Diesel has 402,000 kilometers on it. It don't look real good. Now let's see, did she start? When your Ford won't start, you called in Dodge. Hell of a truck, eh? Oh, I was talking about the Dodge. Uh, the Dodge, you know, it, it actually pulled two vehicles. Yeah. Hell of a truck. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I guess this one's uh, one hell of a truck, too. Yeah. The beer depository hole. Well, at least it's got brakes and power steering and a little optional rust. Falling 
falling out of the ceiling. Even the interior is rotted out. Oh my god. That'll never die. Sure it's hard to make a smooth video when you're driving some jacked up Ford truck. Looking good for October 1st. choice Jetta diesel rules good choice Ford needs Dodge to get it going Ford needs Dodge to get it going <laughs> it's true it's hard to believe that that Dodge has so many more kilometers in this truck and looks like a spring chicken compared to it eh yeah <laughs> how's it running well same as last year it's actually running beautiful Perfect. what started or what just wouldn't crank it fast enough I don't know. I tried it twice, doing lots of cranking and charged the battery in between. That started fine. Instantly. Yeah, well, when you have a tired diesel, they do need more RPMs to get them fired up. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Well, I'm back to the barn. Give her shit. Need a beer. The beast lives again. To die another day, of course. Well, we did make it back, so that's saying a lot for a Ford. Now, if I can pry that bloke out of that Dodge and get him to hop in a Ford, I'll let him take this thing out and see what Ford quality's like. Well, if he ever comes back. We'll let her island warm up. Sounds good, anyways. And no more smoke. First time, even though he's used to drive, and he's used to driving Fords, and it's running actually beautiful. It's in two-wheel drive. Well, he made it. Let's see if he liked it. Hey, thanks. You like oh it? Oh my God, what a tank. <laughs> sure. sure is a difference between driving a Dodge and a Ford, eh? Power steering works good, the brakes work good, the motor runs fine. What's wrong with it? It's dive. Brilliant, yeah. <laughs> yeah, back to the same old spot. Yep, beauty's in the eye of the beholder. Hey, I got an idea! I got an idea. That was a bee on your knee, but you knocked him off. <laughs> but that's the truth, that was a bee on your knee. I got an idea. Shut it off. Okay, uh... Put your foot on the clutch, or unless you have to push it all the way down to make the ignition work. Now put your foot on the gas halfway. See if she'll start now. Now that she's all warmed up. What the? Try again. All right, forget it. 
Starter motor's not cranking her fast enough. One more. She's warming everything. Yeah, let me just get it to the sweet spot. You don't need the glow plugs. That's only one battery, too. Hold it right down. Oh, okay. This gets faster. Try again. Ready? All right. Weird. Well, you know, when there's pumpage and crankage, that's a wanker video. You've got to pump it or it won't start. Okay. Started fine. I might have to take the starter motor apart and lubricate it. It's been through a lot of water, you know. How about this, though? You have to push a button on the other side of the steering column to get it out. Watch it. The first step's a Lulu. <laughs>